This Downey neighborhood will never be the same. More than two dozen trees are getting chopped down. City crews started cutting the pines down this week. Yeah, they've been around for six decades. The trees on Muller Street between Lesterford and Pangbourne have been causing foundation problems. CBS 2's Adriana Weingold spoke to some neighbors who are sad to see the trees go. One by one, 26 huge pine trees on Mueller Street are coming down. The pine trees are at least 100 feet tall and 60 years old. Some residents who grew up in the neighborhood are devastated by the loss of these green giants. I never thought in my lifetime I would see these trees coming down. It's sad. Alvarez and his partner Cricket Clark posted these letters on the trees, thanking them for their shade, hoping the city wouldn't follow through with plans to cut them down. We used to sit in the front yard every afternoon, and yesterday we tried to find shade, and we were uh, huddled on the sidewalk. But other residents say shade is the least of their concerns. They say they were the ones who initiated the project after the roots from the pine trees grew so big they damaged the foundation under some homes and broke through pipes. I don't even have a, a tree in front of my house, but that tree was causing problems to the plumbing. City officials say the community voted overwhelmingly to remove the trees in order to fix the broken sidewalks, plumbing, and foundations. Still, even residents who say the trees are invasive and messy and voted to have them taken out say they're sad to see them go. But when the infrastructure of your house is being affected, the piping and all that, sadly, we needed to make the decision and do it. Residents here say the plan is to replace these big pine trees with smaller trees that have less invasive roots. Reporting in Downey, Adriana Weingold, CBS 2 News.